Here's a quick overview of this WordPress blog. Today I'm going to be giving you a little overview of these this WordPress blog. This uses a WordPress theme, but it, regardless of what theme you use, they mostly all work the same. They just have different functionality once you get inside the admin. If we take a look at the WordPress admin, it's kind of broken up into these areas. Some of these are plugins, but this is the theme, memorable. There's many different themes to choose from, but in this case, we use memorable theme. It's a Woo themes, and it's broken up into these theme options. You can change the the the, the CSS, the, the typography, the header, the home page, and then the contact page. But mostly these are options that are broken up into how the theme works with its framework and then its widgets. You have different widgets that are make up the sidebar, the footer, and the different home pages. That's a basic overview of how this theme works with its admin. The admin is broken up into the theme options, as I explained here, the theme widgets, as explained here, and then each item or content brought in is either a post or a page. If you take a look at pages, there's only three, blog, a draft, and the home page. If you go back to the website, here's blog. If you click back on the original home, uh, this has a separate home page versus the blog. So that's what that page is. And then you have posts. Your posts can be made up of different categories or just one category. You can then see your different SEO options if you have the SEO by Yoast page installed. That's a basic overview of the WordPress admin and how it pulls in different site content. Learn to improve your sales and online leads with masterwebsiteconversions.com.